BFBS Radio. It's Frank McCarthy with you. And we've got the guys from Tin Soldiers. Hello. Hi, hey. Hello. Rich. Hey. Hello, Rich. Hi, Chris. Hello. Hi, Matt. Hi. Good. Right. Introductions done. There's, um, there's normally four of us. Uh, there's just normally another Matt as well. He plays bass. Um, Chris is here on drums. Uh, Matt plays lead guitar and I sing and play guitar. Everyone sings as well, so we have loads of backing vocals. Um, and we formed the band about November 2007. Oh, so not that long ago. That's, that's quite impressive considering uh, where you are musically. Can I just point out that if you go and have a look at the video to it on your MySpace page, which I did earlier, the blonde girls at the front, oh. We, we never <laughs> noticed you at will. the time. No. <laughs> <laughs> we, we were concentrating on the music, yeah, they're, they're honestly. In a they're in more of the video than us, I think. <laughs> <laughs> they probably are. Yeah, but have you seen you lot? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> wow, thank you. <laughs> oh, it's, it's, it's good video, actually. And uh, yeah, why not? Okay, so your next song. That's uh, what I needed. It's we my favourite song. It's your favourite? It's Chris's favourite song. Yeah. Are they totally different? The rock version? Yeah, this is oh, very different. Very yeah. different. Yeah, you can uh, what, you can check it out on on the YouTube at the moment. Okay. So if you just type in the Tin Soldiers and on MySpace as well. And on MySpace, yeah. But that, you know, I love the rock version. But this is a nice little, little nice little take. I won't ask you what it's about. <laughs> <laughs> I won't tell you. <laughs> Sorry. To say, my friends, my friends, can't concentrate anymore. I'm gonna go and dream it all up again, all up again and again. That's when it gets right under, that's when it gets right under your skin. to say what I mean, my friends, my friends, behind a closed door, I can write another thing ever again, ever again, that's when it comes right underneath me, that's when it Spin. 
let's talk about influences. What influences you? When I listen to your music, not so much in the acoustic version, but certainly on your uh, studio kind of full band scenario, I do hear the Lost Prophets, which is a great thing. Okay. A lot of people um, I've noticed say you sound a little bit like Feeder. Yeah, yeah, that's come up quite a lot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe, maybe I hear more Ash than Feeder. Oh yeah, I like okay. Ash. Ash, is a, yeah. Ash is a great band. What are your influences? So let's forget those bands. Maybe they are, maybe they aren't. But what, yeah, what I mean, do you like listening? We just to? try and listen to as much as we can. I think. Yeah, we listen to those kind of indie rock bands, those punk rock bands, um, and that, I suppose, influences the kind of music that we listen to. But I think, musically, you have to listen to everything. You just draw from every sort of area, and sometimes you hear a pop song, or you hear a whatever, you know, song on the radio, and you just pick up something from there. So it can be quite a wide range. Who would you like to support? If you had an ideal oh. scenario, hmm. anyone you can support. The best gig ever would have to have the Foo Fighters and Skunk and Nancy on the bill, but... Skunk and Antsy. Well, Hunt around. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, at the top. <laughs> well, yeah, of course, yeah. I'd be but, happy to feature anywhere on that list. <laughs> I, I saw Skunk and Antsy once. Skin. What a mouth. I know. Huge. Yeah, amazing. <laughs> she is incredible. She is, without doubt, I think, one of the best female vocalists ever in the history of everything. Female She vocalists. is amazing. So if you've got one CD and you're driving to a gig that you all have to agree on, like a pre-show oh, CD... Oh, that never happens. Oh, my we God. We never agree <laughs> on whatever. It would be, it, it would be huge. <laughs> There'd be everything from like John Mayer to It'd Nine Inch Nails <laughs> to Johnny Cash to Foo Fighters to Zeppelin to Skunk and Nancy to. What well, time it is as well? I mean, if it's kind of on the way to a gear, we've got to get fired up and listen to Foo Fighters or something. On the way back at three in the morning, we're not going to be listening to you know, Nine Inch Nails. No, I, it's going I, to be I, something short. Unless I'm driving and I'm <laughs> falling asleep. So it's got to be you all might... the windows open and everyone freezing to death. I sometimes find when I kind of leave the studio after a full day, I just want to listen to classic FM. I've had enough of it.